She wasn't just heading for space, she was rewriting history. Her name, Dr. Mae Jemison, physician, engineer, dancer, dreamer. And in 1992, aboard the space shuttle Endeavour, she became the very first black woman to travel beyond Earth. But this story doesn't start with NASA. It starts in Decatur, Alabama, where a little girl with radiant skin, big eyes, and a mind brimming with curiosity dared to imagine her place among the stars. She excelled in school, devouring books on science, art, and culture. By 16, she was at Stanford. By 25, she was a medical doctor. She served as a Peace Corps physician in West Africa, saving lives and bridging cultures, before deciding to pursue her childhood dream, to go to space. In 1987, she applied to NASA. Out of thousands, she was chosen. Training was grueling, physically, mentally, and emotionally. But May was a force of nature, elegant in her presence, relentless in her determination. And then came September 12th, 1992. As the engines roared and flames lit the morning sky, she strapped in, calm, confident, radiant. That moment wasn't just a launch, it was a statement. We belong here. For eight days, Dr. Mae Jemison orbited Earth 127 times. She conducted experiments in life sciences, tested new technology, and proved, without a doubt, that brilliance has no color limit and space has no gender boundary. She later said, Never be limited by other people's limited imaginations. And she meant it. May's journey lit a fire for millions, especially young black girls, who could now see themselves in the cockpit of a shuttle, leading scientific missions, exploring worlds unknown. Today, Dr. May Jemison continues to inspire through education, advocacy, and her vision for interstellar travel. Because to her, space wasn't just about where she went, it was about where we can all go. The first black woman in space, absolutely gorgeous, fiercely intelligent, and a reminder that the universe belongs to all of us.